This company has just made the world's first fan and wing transition aircraft which means you have fans embedded inside the wings that allow the aircraft to take off vertically with ease. And we are going to explain how it works and some of its features, but the company behind it is called Horizon Aircraft and they have achieved something no one else has managed before. They did a demonstration of their new build, the Cavarite X7, which successfully transitioned from vertical lift to stable wingborne flight using this unique design, marking a first in the EV tall industry. So the way it works is they have 14 ducted fans embedded in the aircraft's wings five in each main wing and another pair in the forward canards. When the aircraft needs to lift off vertically, sections of the wings mechanically slide open to allow vertical thrust from the battery powered fans. As the aircraft transitions to forward flight, the wing surfaces close up, restoring the aerodynamic profile needed for efficient cruising. At this stage, a rear mounted gas turbine takes over, pushing the aircraft forward while also charging the batteries in mid flight. So because it has that dual power system, it gives the X7 a key operational advantage of having full batteries when it reaches its destination, which means fast turnaround times, whether it's for a return trip, another pickup, or a mission critical delivery. Because the X7 can land on almost any helipad rated H1 through H3, as long as it fits the footprint of 50 feet in wingspan and 38 feet in fuselage length. It could land on hospital rooftops, aircraft carriers, or mountaintop resorts with no problem. And because the X7 functions as a normal aircraft once in flight, it meets the requirements for both IFR and VFR operations. That means it can fly in any weather, even through known icing conditions, something very few air taxis or EV tolls can claim. And in terms of performance, Horizon says the X7 can cruise at 288 miles per hour with a range of up to 500 miles. That's around five times farther than many of its all electric competitors and nearly 90 miles per hour faster than the standard Joby S4, which is often seen as a leading contender in this space. If you are wondering why go to the hustle of hiding fans inside the wings instead of going for tilting rotors or external propellers like other EV tolls. According to Horizon CEO Brandon Robinson, the goal was to stick as closely as possible to a traditional aircraft design. The faster it can return to standard wing lift, the more efficient it becomes. Usually helicopters don't hover in place for long and then they start moving forward quickly for that very reason. Wings are just better at generating lift during forward flight and combining that with a turbine for propulsion gives the aircraft the speed and range needed for real world utility. The forward swept wing layout improves performance at slow speeds and high angles of attack, which are critical for a smooth transition from hover to forward motion. The aircraft's design even includes short takeoff and landing capabilities. A 1000 foot runway is all it needs for a conventional launch. Plus redundancy is built into every element of the fan system. During tests, the unmanned demonstrator remained airborne even with nearly a third of its fans disabled. Each fan is independently isolated in terms of electrical, thermal and mechanical systems, which means failure in one won't bring down the whole aircraft. And with all electric fans, noise is significantly reduced, which is an essential feature for urban flying. 